Bring it back. Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today, I wanted to talk about a, a topic which really bothers me. You know, there's um, there's the Luis Ortiz versus Deontay Wilder fight coming up. And um, a lot of people are saying that, oh, Wilder's going to knock Ortiz out, yeah. But um, what, what really bothers me is that people have no respect for the discipline that Luis Ortiz has. Like, I know Wilder has like very strong power. And um, you know, he, he's got power and he does not have any skill at all. Like he's not a boxer, he just knows how to like punch and knock people out, you know. Whereas Luis Ortiz, he's got power and skill, you know. And the other thing which really bothered me was like um, how people were saying he's an old man, like he's only 38 years of age, you know. I mean, Mayweather was 38 to 39 when he first McGregor and he like destroyed him. So like, I don't understand why people are lacking um, like the respect for him but my predictions for the fight is going to be 80% um, uh, to Luis Ortiz and then 20% to Wilder you know um, if Wilder does win the fight um, I'll be really surprised like I said but um, looking at the skill set which uh, Luis Ortiz has he should win and he's fighting for his daughter his family his everything you know these guys put their lives on the line just for this you know so I don't know why people just have like so much disrespect for Luis Ortiz you know he's got a professional record of 20 28 28 and all with like 24 knockouts and then Wilder's like 39 and 38 knockouts zero loss they all have been lost but Wilder again I repeat he's got the, he's got more power more punching power and um, that's all that's all he has he only has power he's got no skills um, he's only has power so uh, and if you look at Luis Ortiz he's got a very good chin you know he's got a chin and a heart he's like um, and he's southpaw as well that's one thing that's gonna cause um, Wilder trouble as well you know because uh, he's left handed you know? and um, and if you look at Luis Ortiz he's, he's like Mike Tyson his neck is like Mike Tyson so it'll be very hard to put that man to sleep you know and he's very very sneaky and skillful and he's very good at countering whereas um, Luis Ortiz uh, whereas I mean Denato Wilder sorry he's not that good at uh, counter attacks so yeah I, I just don't understand why people don't have the respect which is needed um, they keep saying like Wilder 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 but I'm telling you I, I reckon Luis Ortiz is going to win this fight because um, skill is on his side IQ is on his side um, he's just a better fighter and he just um, I don't know he just looks like a proper heavyweight fighter whereas Wilder is just some tall lanky guy you know like if he gets punched in the face he'll go out whereas uh, Luis Ortiz like is very strong neck you know like very good chin his chin can hold up you know um, but it'll be interesting to see. I mean, um, Wilder still has a chance. I, I just see his chances very slim because um, uh, Luis Ortiz is a very avoided heavyweight. No one like wanted to verse him. They're all running away from him. And he just recently knocked out Brian Jennings, who was like a very good American heavyweight. You know, he's never been knocked out. Eh? Even Klitschko didn't knock him out. So yeah, it'll be inter interesting to see. It's happening on the 3rd of March. Um, I'm going for Luis Ortiz. You know, Wilder's got a big mouth. I'm, I, I think it's time someone shuts him up, you know. And then the, the winner of this one is going to verse Anthony Joshua. So uh, my predictions for both the fights, I reckon um, Wilder should lose to Ortiz and then Joseph Parker should lose to Anthony Joshua. So it should be Anthony Joshua versus Luis Ortiz. And um, when that fight does happen, both of them are my favorites. And um, it's a 50-50 fight. I, I, I don't want to think about I wish it can be a draw. I don't want any of them to lose, you know, because I, I, both, I I love them so much you know they just got that attitude um, and again Anthony Joshua is like the knockout sensation he's like 20 20 wins 20 by knockout eh? so all his wins are by knockout eh? that's astonishing he knocked out Vladimir Klitschko Carlos Takim Dominic Brazil Gillian White very soon you'll see me in the heavyweight divisions um, making the top 10 charts hopefully guys and uh, thank you very much for watching today's video guys if you enjoyed please leave a like oh yeah and by the way guys I know I haven't uploaded uploaded last week it's because I couldn't find my camera I recently found it yesterday because I got all my clothes um, so yeah please guys hit the subscribe button and other than that it's been right and I'm out peace